welcome to this weekend's edition of the Gracie Note. It's Gracie, and I am here with Rika. Rika, that's right. She is Swiss Canadian, and she is joining us all the way from Vancouver. And she has released her brand new single and music video for movies. This clip takes us to a glacier, and this place is beautiful. Can you tell us about this location for this music video? Yeah, well, it's on the Frick Pass in Switzerland. Mm -hmm. Crazy. It's like this huge glacier, and there's a man made cave that they make every year. Wow. And it's open from like June to October, and it's, I mean, it's like a long walk inside, inside the glacier. And it's pretty freaky in there. It's like you're surrounded by a glacier, and it's dripping, and you're like, oh it's so cold. Was it? Was yes. it? Yes. <laughs> So cool! Because you're wearing, you're wearing, you know, you have costuming and you are wearing... I'm like wearing no clothes and it's like <laughs> a freezer. <laughs> so, so cold. Were you, what was, what was the atmosphere like? Did you, were you slipping? Were you, because you, you look pretty graceful in the video. So were you, were you slipping or was it, I, there is like it, a, a like on, on the ground there was like wood. Okay. Wood and stuff, so. Behind um, the scenes, and people. Like, yeah. <laughs> Like as we were filming, I was like do do do, and then the camera would be off. I'd be like, <laughs> so we get like curled up. up in a ball <laughs> on the ground, just being like, oh my god. <laughs> well, you pulled it off. You did. You looked very. <laughs> I tried really, really hard. Can you tell me about the song process and everything? Because they're very strong, almost anthem-like lyrics. We co-wrote together in Vancouver, mm -hmm. meeting some friends, and yeah, it took. A few days, it started out totally like a totally different song, and then we we changed a lot of things, and yeah, I don't know. It was just it was like really collaborative. Very cool. Collaborative. Through the through the creation process and changing things and everything, as an artist, do you feel like it was kind of a growing period for you? For the last year, I've been focused on writing a, a pop record. Yeah, yeah. And so I've done a, like I've done a lot of writing and. Uh, I think in the end there was like a hundred songs to choose wow. from. Yeah, so that was like a really crazy process. Just recording it and everything was really amazing. I mean, Warren, <laughs> the producer, uh, he's really on the we're really on the same page. We've been Very working cool. to get to the same page for a long time too. Like we've been, I've been sharing the song with him for like a long time. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. we we really know what we're doing. Like we have the same vision. I know that. Um, you kind of disappeared and went underground writing. Can you tell me for for about that? Like, was it were you by yourself or were you working with others? What was that? What was that kind of time in your life like? I kind of balanced writing alone with writing with other people. Because right, yeah. if I write alone for a long time, I go insane. So <laughs> that's understandable, really right? You know, yeah, it's really it was really good to to collaborate too because like I learned so much about how other people write. And mm -hmm. it's, it's really nice just to have other people as well. Friends. So it's good to have friends. It's good to have other friends. people. It's good to have friends. <laughs> when you were writing movies, if you haven't heard it, definitely check out the music video on on Rika's YouTube channel. Some of the lyrics, especially in in the in the beginning of the song, there's you know I like the way you send uh, my kind of trouble. Is there kind of a couple that you thought of or a relationship that you had in mind that you were kind of writing about that that kind of helped you inspire you or anything? I've definitely like I've definitely had some crazy relationships in my life. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna name specific ones. No but worries. I mean, you know, these things happen. Sure. <laughs> so it wasn't like you saw film and kind of were inspired. It was it was like uh, real life stuff. Um, yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Cool. I mean, I definitely take from from my experiences and especially from I think this record has a, I took a lot from like my teen years. Oh, very like, cool. Kind of working through that. So Nice. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> For this record, did you kind of do you feel more like the boss? I'm in charge now. I can I can go with who I want to work with. I can call the shots. I can do everything myself. Or have you always felt like that in your music? The always the driving force. I think I've always felt like that. <laughs> Good for you. Good for I've you. always had the freedom to choose who I want to work with and what kind of music I want to make. So I've been lucky like in that way. 
Very cool. What can fans, what can fans expect from you next? Um, I think we're going to release a new single um, slowly. Um, this one just came out like yeah, yeah. two weeks ago or something. I know, so. it's so exciting. <laughs> Um, so we're going to keep releasing singles. I think the album will come out next year. Very cool. Yeah, I, uh, it's called Beatitudes. The record is called Beatitudes. How did that kind of come about? How did that come to be? Well, the Beatitudes, like from the Bible, yeah. uh, it's kind of like, they're kind of like shout outs to the underdog. Yeah, because they're like, blessed are the meek, for yeah. they will be, you know, and all that sort of all thing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so very so much I, so. I, I thought that was cool, and I'm not... Like, I, I grew up religious, mm -hmm, but I'm, mm -hmm. I'm not, like, I'm spiritual now, I'm sure, not really sure. religious, but I still, you know, it's still part of my life. Guys, that's very cool. Shout out to the underdog from Rika coming up on her, on her new album next year, The Beatitudes. She worked her butt off in that glacier <laughs> and awesome cinematic movies, music video, definitely watch it on her YouTube channel and you can check everything out at www.rika.com. And before you go, I mean, you have a sneak peek on the Gracie note of her acoustic performance of movies, which will give you utter goosebumps. Her voice mm -hmm. is so powerful in the acoustic rendition. So before you go, can we can we sing a chorus of it together? Sure. Oh my gosh, that would be so sure. so awesome. So guys, we're gonna be we're gonna be right back in a split second, and we're gonna we're gonna belt it out. Truth is what we wanted to be. No one. Knows Tune in next week for the Gracie Note. Visit Rika at www.rika.com. And with me, I hope you will be graceful. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Thank you. Bye.